All right, and just like that, we're live. Welcome back to Center Punch TV. Center Punch TV, everyone. Um, we're going to try some NASCAR oval style racing here at Las Vegas. So I'm here with uh, KCE Racing League, and uh, we're going to turn 107 laps out here. Um, got our qualifying done, so we're about a minute and a half before we grid up. But uh, I managed to get on the inside out there in seventh, kind of having some struggles, hence the okay. title of this thing. Um, it's going to be a soul-crushing experience for me tonight. Trying to get back into ovals, mainly spend most of my time on the roadside, but uh, I'm going to give it a shot here tonight and see uh, see if I can keep from tearing this thing up. Um, over the past few weeks, I've had some struggles with the streaming, trying to get it all sorted out, trying to develop a good product, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, um, we're going to be running these cars. I'll be doing a broadcast race here, um, let's see, on Thursday night at the same track. Uh, cup cars again uh, with another league, so I'm excited about doing the broadcast with Scott. So that's going to be... Anyway, um, like I said, we're here at Las Vegas. Fixed setups, uh, using the Vegas setup here. Um, 107 laps, it looks like it's uh, afternoon. We're running about mid-80 track temperature, so fairly decent. The car Thanks does second. get... Um, fairly loose on the long run so hopefully just manage the rear end of this thing and uh hopefully we can keep this thing green everybody was doing pretty well during practice so um, but i did notice a lot of guys slowing down for um the looseness of the cars um so hopefully maybe i can make up some positions and not be the one that uh, kills everybody tonight anyway so we got uh, maybe about 10 more seconds we're gonna hop in the car and uh start off with my seventh place calling um there is no auto start restart um, thing, so I have to manually start the car. So I like to jump in early to make sure uh, I get this thing started and without killing it, turn it on the ignition, that whole jazz. All right. Let's give her a shot. Let's see what we can do. We're on one to go. Just be smart about who's on your outside there. So we actually got the car started, so that's something. Let's not kill it on the line here. The road's closed. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, my streaming Outside software has been giving me doing. fits. I You're thought wrong. I had it fixed, but apparently I didn't. Let's see. Yeah, thank you. So anyway, the last uh, couple we of oval races here, I've gotten booted. Um, not from the league, of course, but connection issues, streaming issues. I don't know what the problem is. And I was two laps into the race at California last week uh, in second place and got booted. So that was uh, kind of left a bad taste in my mouth. So hopefully it doesn't happen tonight. Hey Eric, I'm going to pull up high here. Go ahead and pass me. Should be starting behind the 15. So because the car was getting so loose, uh, after about 15 laps, it starts getting really sketchy. So you can go about 35 laps on a tank of fuel. Um, but after about 15 laps, if you're not being careful, it just gets really sketchy, especially on the exit of um, turn two here so we'll run a little bit higher groove once we get the field sorted out and hopefully there isn't a bunch of cautions we've got five sets of tires i believe is what they I said kind of tied up so you can't see the logo the let me see yeah the don't go the counting the set i'm on lane, so you can see there line, four left finish line. good luck everybody nice job front row edward i'm gonna pit on first lap yeah, me too. All right. Sin City, here we come. Try not to make a mockery of this. Just try to be as best you can to be on your game here. Give myself a little bit more volume there. How right, about pace cars off? Be ready. Green flag. Outside. Still outside. Clear high. Outside. 
Some guys are backing out. Probably to save tires. I wasn't expecting to pull positions like that already, but where we're at, okay, I need to settle in now. Oh, and I just got tagged. Hopefully no damage. Hey, Todd. Hey, you probably uh, in Crescent. Probably already seen me get tagged in the rear end there. Starting off early. Maybe I can start that rage monkey. 79, pinning out. Well, we're up from 7th, from 4th. This is lap 3 or 4. These guys coming out right now had to serve a penalty, so... I'm just trying to take care of the tires, actually. Yeah, I hope so, Todd. These guys up front are really hustling, but I think that's going to be a mistake for them, so I am not trying to keep up. Yeah, I put that chat down below where I could read a little bit easier. It's still kind of hard to read. And Chris and I got no beer tonight, so I'm uh, going to have to do this dry. No balling. Nathan back there coming back up on me. You want? Just not interested in pushing yet. And I'm running about a lane up, so because running that low lane really puts a lot of pressure on the rear tires. And actually, it looks like we're starting to reel these guys in. And I can already feel that looseness starting to set in here. I'm actually really white knuckling here. I'm so nervous about when the car starts getting loose. But at least I'll know what's going on. There goes. That's exactly what I'm talking about right there. And that's probably because he was down there running on the bottom. I really wasn't watching that car in particular, but man, you just get the rear end so hot. Anyway, when I call the race on Thursday, at least I'll know what's up. Now this league runs 60% fuel, and over on the other side, in the race I call, they run uh, about 53%, so a little shorter stints. And it looks like I got Nathan closing in back there. Yeah, it's 
starting to get a little edgy. 11 laps in. Kind of surprised with the leader running that low line like that. Well, something happened to Nathan and I got Coco coming up on me now. Managing tires, managing tires. Sorry, Danny, that was Nate. Staying high, Nate. Staying high for me. Oh. Oh, shit. Yep, there it goes. Right at lap 14. And knock that crap off. Yeah, Coco oh, Pops. I think that's what everybody calls them. He's actually the league owner. <laughs> Hey, Eric, are you okay? Uh, I'm getting repairs right now. Only comfort I got, I know, is that everybody that in front fault. of me is just as loose as I am. Yeah, that was a big checkup. I couldn't... Yeah, there was nothing you could do there. Then I got Dave, who's lapped down, but uh, looks like he's pretty stout. He had to go in and serve a penalty right off the bat, so that's why he's up here. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. That's no good. Yeah, I might have to think about running a different line because I'm just holding even, but I'm not seem to be gaining. Try something else. Thought running that higher groove would be better, but uh, so far, not yet. About halfway through the field run here. My hands are sweating. caution yet I'd like to get green flag stop in once in a while
The game plan is uh, clean and green. <laughs> I'm going to pit about lap 35, I think. Oh, there you go. There's a the random. Oh, there. See, there you went and jinxed it, uh, Crescent. Uh, and I suck at hitting these cars right now. I haven't ran these in so long. Hello, Janice. But you know, that shows you how clean these guys are. Um, we went 22 laps, kind of a big field. I think there's like 35 cars in it and no incidents. Cars off a two. Check it up on the back stretch. Uh, all right, four tires and fuel, and then back out we come. Hopefully, I don't screw up my pit stop. Base cars in three. I think I'm going to have to manage uh, the next run a little bit better than I did that run. Oh, really? That's a bummer. You know what? I, I thought I had it fixed. And, uh, anyway, let me do this. The whole thing's starting to get on my nerves. Coming at you, fellas. We are 10 away. Five away. At sure mark now. Come on, turn in, turn in. Stop on your mark. Yeah, freaking. I'd even checked the overlays, but yeah. Came out second, so I actually did pretty well on that. I gained a position. Downside is I'm on the outside. <laughs> so, probably going to get a little bit of a freight train going on the start. Uh, he's pulling over on the back straight away. Let everybody by. Oh. I was wondering. Oh, hey, John. Yeah. Center punch it. Well, this is the type of track to do it on. Doing a little bit of NASCAR. And right when I had, I thought I had all the streaming stuff fixed, and I'm just, it's so disappointed. I don't know what to do anymore. I just knew I followed you it's off the lane. It really worked the other day. I, I, yeah. I did something for a friend, and it was working, and I was able to, and I checked it even again today, and it was working, and then uh, all of a sudden it does it. I wonder if it has to do too. with the bit rates and all that. Well, yeah, you got was, a full field and there's a lot of road more than my speed. There's a lot of transmission going back and forth with all the cars on the track. I wonder if that has something to do with it. It just gets overloaded. Yeah, these are the next gen Chris. Behind you, Chris, I think we're good. So this is what you raced last year on no, the road really courses at least once. I think you were it at Coda or something. Know what it's doing, does it? Sorry, pace car. Did that road two. course ro race? There it goes. Now it's in past you. <laughs> oh, my fault. Yeah, I would have rather been in. Yeah, user error. Thanks a lot. Probably. Actually, I think it's an ASUS problem. I think because I installed the bloatware when I shouldn't have from the ASUS I mean, motherboard. I, I just haven't been but able to get rid of it all. And tires, I don't know. I'm just guessing at this point. Yeah. Let's take a look and see how many right. cars we got back there, Todd. So. Yeah, 36. Uh, uh, 31 cars. Yeah. Staying high. Luggy dog pit. No pit limiter. <laughs> We don't do that. It's NASCAR. What was that? I'm going to take the low side. I had the lucky dog pit, so it's Info. a lap late. I want to go. Yeah, John, uh, it outside. is uh, a fake Mustang. Just like I'm in a fake Camaro. Oh, it's NASCAR. So, hey, these aren't stock cars anymore. They just put stickers on them to make them look like whatever manufacturer you want them to look like. It's 
That's why I prefer the roadside more than NASCAR nowadays. It's just gotten too far away from its uh, where it used to be. The 87 cars, though, they do have an 87 series. That's oh, that's my favorite series. And Todd's good at this track. I've raced him here before too. Todd's kind of hard on the tires, though. All right, on the outside, so I'm going to get passed by a few cars here, unfortunately. Probably. We'll see. Maybe I can tuck in. <laughs> Take out the crowds. I guess I don't have enough context there. All right, here we go. I need to let him go. Just gonna cook off my tires here. There we go. I'm fall in behind him for now. Well, he's making the bottom line work, so let me try it, I guess. Yep, typical Chevy driver. <laughs> I only have one Chevy left. I'm almost a Japanese car driver now. I still got the Avalanche, that's it. Go low, Kennedy. Never mind. Super focused right now. Yeah, typical Subi driver here. You got that right. Freaking granola bars. Microdosing. Grabbing some ass in the back. <laughs> At least he can do that. Yeah, screw the rainbow sticker stuff, man. I put things in their proper hole. I think you're thinking of oval drivers now there, John. Or Jeff. Oh, I got Mullen here. Uh, Greg, hey, Jeff. Say that about Wasn't even sure you got that. Did you guys watch uh, NASCAR race today? Uh, 
Now Jeff's been over to my house watching me do this shit live. Okay, anytime the rear end is going to start breaking out on this car, so I have to be careful. Pressure from the 48 now. I'm trying to just stay back here and take it easy, but it's about four guys. We're all running about the same, so. Oh, he's on the apron. Oh, and I'm loose too. Outside. Still outside. Charger on the outside. Still outside on your corner. Still outside. Yeah, he doesn't want to give it up. Still outside. No, we're touching. Whew. That was the dead I owed. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> All right, baby, that's neat. Cars are loose now. That was stressful. We're up front now though. Uh, for how long, I don't know. I don't know how much goody I kicked, cooked off these tires. It looks like it's about to end right here. Got the 48. On the grass for a stretch. Let him go here. Try to cool clear, these clear. bad boys back down. Oh, that's a bummer. You guys lost me. Did you? I see you guys. Just had to go through the grass. Pretty good. Just dart over from back here. It sounds like somebody got off track. Who got the power move? The uh, 48 there, Todd? The Jimmy Johnson machine there, Robert? Good old Bob. Yeah, we're back into very loose conditions again, so yeah, be careful. And that might have wore too much tire off this thing. Sorry, 35. I was too greedy and wanted to lead, I guess. I was chasing that some bitch three different times. All right, we're back down on the bottom, I guess. Let's try that. I do something. <laughs> that was my problem too.
Oh, he's up in the wall up front here. I don't oh, think he heard it. Stay high in one and two. Let the, let the lead lap cars go by. Hello, Tim. Hello. Gotta get through the traffic, Tip forward. Thank you, sir. Thanks. Thanks. Bye. Go outside. Go kind of here. was a cool car that 19. With that gold chrome. Whoa. Mine. I'm down on the apron there. And turn two walls, but that's besides the point. <laughs> Them fruity pebbles are made by post. They're just a little bit better. Coming from Ed Post, I guess. Of course, you young guys don't remember that. Not that young. Oh, I, ah, I figured you did, Greg. Why did you bench you as old? Okay. I still eat them. Fighting the hell out of this damn thing. Should be getting paid for this. That was the old post uh, TV advertising. Hey Jeff, how you been doing anyway? Just a little bit better than Kellogg's. Haven't started pulling away so far, but man, it's everything I can do. Well, thank you, B. Thank you. I've used up all my bag of tricks. I don't have any left. Thanks, Portland, huh? Thing, Hope you had on. lots of ass tape with you. Bowling, how'd you guys do? So we're about 10 laps away from uh, pit stops here. And, and it looks like we're all pretty competitive, so and he just got really sideways. Ninety-four on scale of one to ten. How bad is my front? We're starting to pull away from the guys behind us, at least. But man, it took the whole run to do it. No titles, bummer. Not too shabby though. Yeah, the way tonight's going, I don't see a title in my future either. Maybe the wall. Man, tires are like screaming, get me off. About to the halfway point, too. Man, these guys are good at being clean. Really appreciate that. They're so clean, they have to throw fake caution flags.
Well, we're starting to not drive the 48 right now, but catching them and getting around them, two different things. And I'm so damn loose at the moment. Like he's just gonna let me go, which is well, I thought he was. All right, back up to second and see where we are on the field here. So they get out of the corner. My arms are getting tired. Seven laps. Even getting sideways here in the tri oval. Can't tell it probably by watching, but it's like drifting through that tri oval. That team stays high. Oh. There we go. There's a big little wash out there. Four spitting this time. Okay. We got cars pitting, so. I didn't even hear him call that out, so. Got five more laps before I have to come in. 36, 30. Nice work. New leader. 48, baby. Okay, the 48's going in this time. That'll give me a little bit of breathing room for my pit stop. Oh, and then I do that. 189, baby. All right, green flag stops. 79 pitting. Now, I've been out here longer than the leader, so I am not going to come out in the lead. But I'll have fresher tires, hopefully. 94, I'm so sorry about that. Bottom of yours, Tony. Here you go, Tony. 10 is pitting. 11 pitting, this time by. This time by. 187 pitting this time. Oh, way early. That was dumb. Not the greatest pit stop. Pit entry. It's better than getting a speeding ticket, though. Come, fellas. Ten away. Five away. Turn in, turn in, turn in, turn in. Nice and smooth here. Leaving on me. All right. Whew. 48 out. 189. 98 out. 79 pitting out. 25. with the 48 and I have a lap newer tires so that'll be helpful later on if it stays green Lap cars are super slow. They're on old tires. Oh, so scary. I don't know why he's down in the bottom like that. <laughs> I have no idea what that was about here. So TJ is the guy we're chasing down. He's 3.5 seconds ahead. He's got a couple laps older tires. He went in earlier than the rest of us so I'm gonna de-stress at this moment and just kind of take it easy hopefully these guys are just coming out they're gonna be on fresh tires 
cut. They're way behind, so hopefully we we'll have to. 87 pitting out. Get it going. Thanks, Ed. Yep, no problem. Yeah, he's slowing us down big time. Uh, he ain't racing anybody, but I guess he's maybe in the lucky dog. I can't tell, but I hope he is to be. Or the 48's just not putting the pressure on him he needs to. I don't know. What's the nickname of the 12? I didn't catch it. I've only been with these guys uh, a couple months, so I don't know all the ins and outs. I knew, no, we're getting mired up in traffic. Outside. I don't know why I think Clear. Ed there took two tires. That's why he's so off the pace. You know Ah, uh, killing me. Outside. Uh, leader, well, we gained three tenths on him, so that's something at least. The bull. I don't know, maybe he's full of bullshit. I feel like center punching somebody. 19 accident. This is where my rage monkey starts coming up. Get the F out of the way. Freaking like, oh, oh shit. Wow. He, Sorry, I almost, hit hey, no worries. I did my best to keep off of you. That was what you call a close call. All right, see what we got for the leader here. Yeah, I know, John. I figured you'd appreciate that. Get some center punching going yet. Better than clown punching. Hey guys, make sure you like the video and stuff. I'm trying to get this out there, so uh, if you want it, if you'd be so kind, could use the support. And by the way, I seen your uh, glider video there, uh, John. That's actually a nice looking glider. Kind of surprised coming from Horizon. We're slowly catching the leader. Yeah. Pretty much got all Caribou Lou here, Team Caribou Lou. And we are getting loose again. And uh, there'll be a random caution again, so. Next time we pit, we won't have to pit again. I think we're within our window now. And 
I imagine by the time I catch up to TJ, he's going to head to pit lane, but man, it's kind of risky with their random caution flags. Yeah, that gentle, that gentle lady was a good airplane. It was the first glider I ever flew. Well, since I'm going to be retired this summer, hopefully I can make it out to Wenatchee. It'll be really cool. Man, I'm close to putting this thing in the wall. I got some heat on the rear end here. No pun intended. No rainbow stickers on this car. 72 is fast. I believe he's one of the faster guys in the league. And I am not doing what I need to do to run him down, so. And Tim behind me is really fast too, so. He started, I don't think he got a good call in because he started quite a ways back there, I believe, but he's coming be lucky uh, to get a top five out of this thing. We're not even catching a tenth of a lap. And I think it's because I'm charging this corner too hard. I ain't gonna hold you up. <laughs> We're good. Yeah, now he gained on me. Thank you, George. Yeah, I might have to move that chat box again, Todd or Crescent. It's hard to see, at least in this series. So here comes the short pitting now. Five spinning, Adam. Five spinning. So that guy that's calling out his pit, they're short pitting because they know they can make it the rest of the day. They'll have fresh tires and maybe make up some time. Only problem is with the random caution, you end up a lap down. And as clean as this race has been, I would love to short pit right now, but. because ideally this is about the right time to come in. But we gotta hedge our bets for the stupid random cautions. This time. But we are nearing the end of this thing. Yeah, the draft doesn't work like you think it does on these places. And sometimes the car behind is at a disadvantage because you get arrow push in the corners and you can't actually get around the leader. So the guy up front is just really fast. And the only way I'm going to beat him is to be better. And so far that ain't happening. No, they're not. They're not on specific laps. They say they got a rash, huh, random caution generator. I have no idea how it works. Out. We're gonna have cars that are gonna be really fast lap cars that are coming out pit lanes, so we gotta be careful with that. It's about a two-second difference between fresh tires and old tires. Yeah, and we're just not running TJ down. As a matter of fact, I'm getting ran down at the moment. And I 
thought I was taking care of my equipment, but apparently not good enough. And I think TJ just got sideways there. He and the tenth on him. Or no, he's letting the lap car go by, I guess. I'm sweating now. Yeah, I have fresher tires, but I think I used too much of them there, Chris. It's been a while since I've been on ovals, so. I'm happy I'm even doing this well at this point. Maybe it's because I don't have that drink next to me. All right, so everybody behind me is pitted, almost. This is where it gets uh, what to do, what to do. I just know I'm gonna get burned if I go in, but it's probably what I need to do. Well, TJ's staying out. So everybody that went in is going to be faster than I am, so I think I'm coming in next time by. Oh. Yeah. I'm going to shit myself there. 22 this time. 22 this time. I do need caribou. 10 pity. Three. 79 spitting this time. Surprised that caution didn't come out. Come, guys. It's usually what Fire happens way. to me. All right, get Five that car way. going. Can't see and my pit stall. That was a slow. Oh, and I'm not even in the zone. Well, I screwed that up. Thought I was close enough. Damn it. Thanks, Danny. You can't give up time like that. Call. Oh, there's the random caution. Yeah, participation trophy time. Fuck, Janice. Fuck, we're gonna run out of tires, man. <laughs> I know. <laughs> she had to come uh, out like, like five more laps from that. As long as I stayed on the lead lap, I should be good. This might work out for me, but if I'm a lap, I could be a lap down. So we got caught a lap down. We're on the tail end of the lead lap. She said she loved me. <laughs> this is what happens, man. This is hey, work work your butt off, man. And <laughs> they do this crap. Amazing. If I'd have stayed out one more lap, then I'd have been in the. So he, he got the lucky dog. This is just such horse shit. Total horse shit. So I guess we'll have a pack of Yeah, shut up. Here. Shut up, Chris. I guess. We'll be hauling ass. I'm, at least I got fresh tires, but when I get the wave around, I mean, it's good. Every, the whole field is going to be in front of me. Yeah, Chris, you try to clutch one of these and hit your box. It's freaking hard. <laughs> Without a doubt. You know, I know 
Todd. I swear to God, I swear I ain't coming back to these ovals when they do this shit. And I always do, man, because I, I do kind of love it. But, yeah, just not letting crap happen. I just car turn three. naturally is just about as frustrating as it gets. So we will get the wave around. So I am still going to be on the lead lap up way back in the field. Not how many cars are a lap down. Yeah, this is going to be some serious. Uh, well, there's only seven cars right now. Um, wait, am I going to be stuck a lap down? Let me double check. No, me and the 48 should go. So I guess there's only eight cars, so that's not too bad. But really have to hustle it. Uh, the lights didn't go out yet. Dang it. One right more lap. I do have fresh tires, man. I'm going to be able to run this thing hard. It's a low line. We're all gonna start at the bottom. But I'm gonna be behind anyway. all the lap cars, so yeah, this is whoever's fit. got the lead, please call last so we know we're coming up to it. Here goes my rage monkey. This is what exactly right. what I'm talking Next about. Fucking bullshit. You do everything you need to do to stay up front and just freaking have these random bullshit, man. <laughs> these are good guys though, man, so that's why I don't give up on them. I kinda enjoy racing with them, but I want to kick myself for coming into pit lane when I did. Stayed out one more lap, and I wouldn't be in this situation. I'd probably be leading right now. Come in and get some fresh tires and ready to settle this thing. <sighs> Damn it. And I don't know if I, I posted a link down there in the stream where you guys can check the outside view of what's going on in the league down there in the comment section. If you guys wanted to see an outside view of the race. <laughs> That's a good idea, Jeff. Usually when I drive angry, though, I usually do pretty good, man. Let's start moving these. Pace cards, start finish. All right, here we go. Come on. Lights going. Should go out. Here we go. Let's go. You're on the inside. Close. Yeah, I know, Crescent. Sometimes it feels like uh, they're out to get me with these caution flags. And now that we're at the end of the race, we're at the back of the field, everybody's going to be going for it. So the caution's going to come out. There's going to be a big, big wreck in front of me, and I'm going to lose my shit because I'm going to get caught up in it. Car going into three. Oh. Here we go. Nice car in four. So we do have some lap. Those are the lap cars all in front of us. And they're all racing, so they're not going to give anything. Go on the flag. Be ready. Green, green. Oh, yeah. Good. Well, I didn't center punch anybody. Yeah, now I'm angry. Uh, outside. Get out of spot. Get out of spot. That's where no, I start. And I got damage on the back of this thing, I'm sure, so that's going to affect it. God dang it. Thank 
Huh. Opened it up and shut it on me. Thing, buddy. Almost wrecked us both. Working outside, outside. You're clear now. That's what happens. I'm driving angry now. All right, it keeps outside. opening the bottom outside. like that. I have to check up hard to keep from wrecking them. Get up here, Jerome, you had a boat. Yeah, we're almost 10 to go. Clear. Outside. Still there. Still outside. Clear. They're outside. I about got the apron there. That was scary. Look at this lap car just running me as hard as possible. We're all racing for the win and got a lap car. One of the admins for the league. It's just not a big picture racer. Let me know when you're up here, Greg. I'll go hop with you. Actually, I take that back. <laughs> I'm so focused, I have to apologize. It's not who I thought it was. I apologize to whoever I cussed out just then. Guess that was for position. Where's my chat? Keeping me honest. <laughs> I need the hack button at this point, and I got damage on the back of this thing, man. I'm going as hard as I possibly can at the moment, which is gonna, I'm gonna pay for this later. And we got eight laps to go. As soon as I see I get incident points, man, those rage, mon rage monkeys really start coming out of me. Yeah, and I'm starting to slow down. I think uh, I'm in trouble. Staying hot, Nathan. Staying hot. Same thing, J Man. Well, at least I'm not up front. You guys got something to see out the windshield. Nineteen's in the wall. Don't you stop. Uh, I am pushing hard. We got five to go this time by.
Yeah, I have to apologize to the guy I was racing earlier. I thought you were a lap car. I don't know why. It's going to bother me now, but Tim is all over me. This is when the cars are starting to get really free right now, too. Yeah, he's going to get this from me. I'm not going to... I'm not gonna fight him. Uh, not yet, anyway. Go there, go there. Whoa, super scary, that was close. And we're trying to go three wide here. Holy balls. I had to give it up. This is where my damage is. Uh, Slow me down. Come on, Greg. Get up there and get in that fight. Yep. Outside. Still outside. Still outside. White flag this time. Still out there. Well, that was everything I could muster. Clear high, clear high. Outside. Clear high, clear high. Outside. Come out there. Come out there. Nice Good win there, TJ. TJ. Thanks. Good win, TJ. Good win, TJ. Yeah, I'll take this seventh, I guess. Great to keep it. Oh my goodness. Nice run, Bosworth. Thank you, thank you, you too. Congrats, TJ. Everybody, man, it was it was a lot of people moving. Great run, Troy. Congrats, TJ. Thanks, guys. Should have never been put in that situation. Those caution flags. Job, man, I tell you. If you want to see a meltdown, they're coming. Good win, TJ. <laughs> Thanks, Paul. They are a coming, man, because that's Thanks, guys. some serious BS. Anyway, I appreciate you guys showing up and watching again. That was uh, that was fun. Sorry I wasn't as engaged as last time, but I actually had to focus this time. You get it, Danny? All right, let's see what kind of damage I got on the back of this. Yeah, that'll be good. Might not be that bad. I can pause it. Let's see, uh, rear chase here. Oh, that's the wrong one. Must be front. Far chase. Here we go. Oh, I actually don't have that much damage. I don't really see any. So it wasn't as bad as I thought. I was just for dri driving it too hard. Hey, I gave it my best. Anyway. Thanks, Paul. That was fun running. Yeah. Yeah, hell yeah, it was. Yeah, no, I wasn't I wasn't killing it, though, Todd. So if anything, uh, although I will say it gave uh, TJ the advantage because he, uh, he just got his pit stop and was able to get the lucky dog. And so... It benefited him and it hurt me, so. Yeah, oh, I bet Crescent. Yeah, my eyeballs probably were, man. I give it the best. Ah, shit. It's kind of disappointing. That three wide there at the end, man, that made it super exciting. <laughs> anyway, I guess uh, I shall call it a night. And uh, again, thanks for uh, showing up. I should go back. I should uh, take a look at that, too. Let's take, take a look at that three wide stuff here. So I am in that green and white number 10 car. And you can see the 95 there on the outside, right behind me. Let's see if we get a better view than that. There we go, here's where we're going three wide. Oh, I see the damage on the back of my car now too. I don't know if it really affected anything, though. It isn't too bad. 
Anyway, that's pretty scary when you're on old tires and cars are dancing all over the place. Yeah, I'm not going to call nothing yet, but... I'm just more mad that I got those incident points uh, on that restart. That was uh, something I pride myself on, is not getting incident points. And so much for that tonight. And that comes with oval racing, too, because um, yeah, it just happens. All right, guys, man. What happened on that last restart? Oh, so, well, you can't pass the leader. You can't really jump the start. And so I had to back up because everybody checked up on the start. And um, so the guy behind me didn't check up, and he just got into the back of me, and that's what happened. And so punched me pretty hard, gave me a 4X. And 6X makes you do a, it's a black flag penalty here in this league. So just imagine that, you know, um, just two taps like that will make you do a drive through. So yeah, it's kind of a bummer. I wanted zero incidents. I'd have been happy with the seven. I'd have been happy with the seventh place finish and um, no incident points, but now I'm angry because I got four incident points and ended up in seventh. So yeah, it is what it is. We'll come back and try it next week. Anyway, Jeff, hey, thanks for showing up, man. Yeah, we'll see you next week. Or, uh, yeah, I'll be out Wednesday night, hopefully. and uh, Or tomorrow night I'm doing a road course race. I think we're at uh, that Norway track. And then I'll probably loop it there. And then uh, we'll be doing a fun race on Wednesday night. So, anyway, hope to see you guys there. Um, and anybody else that's watching, thanks for showing up. Like, subscribe. And we'll catch you guys all next time. Catch you later.